everybody. It's Miss Denise again from the Outreach Department at the Carroll County Public Library. And I'm here to talk to you about, can you guess? Yes, it's ice cream. You know, I don't know where Corky is. He's been making some noise in the kitchen and just not sure where he is. Corky, Corky, oh Corky, where are you? <laughs> Corky, what is all over your face? Oh, oh, what are you talking about? What do you mean? There's nothing on my face. Corky? Uh-oh. Corky, were you into the ice cream? Were you eating ice cream? Well, well yeah, maybe. I think I was. Hmm. And I'm guessing you had some vanilla ice cream, didn't you, Corky? Oh, yeah. Yes, I did. But I love ice cream, Miss Denise. You know, Corky, I know you love ice cream, and I love ice cream, too. And I was thinking that today we could talk about ice cream. Maybe we could go see some ice cream somewhere. Oh, that would be great. I was thinking, Corky, I could take you to a special place to talk about ice cream. And maybe we could even make some ice cream. Oh, that would be so nice. All right, Corky, will you go and wipe your face, and then... We'll come back and we'll talk about some ice cream, okay? And maybe we'll go someplace special. Okay, I'll be right back. Oh. oh, that Corky, he's so silly, isn't he? Well, I thought today we could talk about ice cream and I'm going to take Corky somewhere special and I hope you come along with me. So first, we're going to do this little glove puppet. Look, it's just a glove with some ice cream cones on it. And it goes like this. Five little cones. Do you think there really are five? Let's count them. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. That's right, five. And you can put your fingers up too and pretend that you have five little ice cream cones on you. Five little ice cream cones in an ice cream shop. Round and fat with sprinkles. Do you see the sprinkles? On top, along came a kitty cat with a quarter one day. He bought a yummy cone and he took it away. How many cones are left now? Four. One, two, three, four. Four little ice cream cones in an ice cream shop, round and fat with sprinkles on top. Along came a bunny rabbit. With a quarter one day, he brought a yummy ice cream cone and then he took it away. How many are left now? One, two, three. That's right, can you do three on your fingers? Three, three's a tricky one. Three little ice cream cones in an ice cream shop, round and fat with sprinkles on top. Along came a spider with a quarter one day. He bought a yummy cone, whoop, and he took it away. How many are left now? Two, yes, that's right, one, two. Two little cones in an ice cream shop, round and fat with sprinkles on top. Along came a squirrel. With a quarter one day, he bought a yummy cone and took it away. How many are left? One, that's right. One little cone in an ice cream shop, round and fat with sprinkles on top. You came along with a quarter one day. You bought that yummy cone and took it away. How many cones are left now? Zero, no cones. Good job, my friends. Look what I have here now. I have five ice cream cones. That's right, one, two, three, four, five, five ice cream cones. Five little ice cream cones, so good to eat. The first one said, I'm a special treat. The second one said, that looks like chocolate chip ice cream, doesn't it? It's such a hot day. The third one said, I'm melting away. The fourth one said, don't lose your top. And the fifth one said, oh dear, kerplop. And there he fell. That's a silly little rhyme. All righty, Corky, oh Corky, it's time to make some ice cream. Where are you? Ha <laughs> ha here I am. Corky, we're gonna make some ice cream now. Oh, yay, goody, what kind are we gonna make? Well, I think for today, we'll make vanilla. Oh, I love vanilla. It's cool and creamy, and I could put sprinkles on it. Some people call them jimmies. 
That's right, some people do call them sprinkles and some call them jimmies. And I could put syrup on it, or marshmallow, oh, hot fudge, a cherry and some whipped cream. Yes, Corgi, we can do all kinds of things to add to our ice cream. Yeah, but I think I'm gonna start with plain vanilla. Sounds like a good idea. All right, Corgi, so here's what we need to make our ice cream. We need a big Ziploc, Ziploc bag, that's a gallon size. And we need a smaller quart size Ziploc bag. Okay, I got that, two bags. Mm -hmm. And we need a tablespoon measuring spoon. That's to measure the sugar, which I've already measured into this little cup, okay. And then we need a half a teaspoon measuring to measure the vanilla. Oh, here's the vanilla corky. Would you like to smell it? Yes, please. <laughs> oh, doesn't that smell so good? Oh, it sure does. And vanilla flavoring is a very important part of our vanilla ice cream, but you also use it in other flavors of ice cream as well. So that's our vanilla, and I've already poured what we need into this little baby cup. And then we need some half and half or some milk. Oh, where's that? Where's that? Here it is. I'm using half and half, a half a cup of half and half, but you can use milk. You can even use almond milk or, you know, some other kind of milk if you're lactose intolerant or you just don't choose to drink regular milk. And then we need some salt, any kind of salt will do. And we need a lot of ice. Woo! -hoo -hoo. I know, that's cold, isn't it, Quirky? Yep. So here we go. Quirky, I'm going to sit you down right here in front of me so you can help me, okay? Okay. All right, so Quirky, the first thing we're going to do, we're going to take our little Ziploc bag, and into that we're going to pour the milk for the half and half. There you go. There it is. It's in there. What color is that, Corky? Oh, that's white. Yep, that's right. That's white. We're going to pour the sugar into there. There it goes. And we're going to pour the vanilla into there. There we go. There's the vanilla. All right, so it's all in there. We're going to seal it up really, really, really well. Make sure that it's got a nice, tight closure. We're just going to mix it a little bit. Okay, we're just going to mix see that. We're just going to mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it a little bit. Then we're going to take the big bag. Oh, that is a big bag. Yes, it is. That's a gallon size bag. And we're going to put some of the ice into the bag. Oops. <laughs> and then we're going to put our ice cream bag, here it is, into the big bag. Okay. And I'm going to put this down on the table so I can pour the rest of the ice into there. Okay, here we go, Corky. The rest of the ice into there. So now we have a lot of ice in there and our bag. And then we're going to pour about a half a cup of salt onto that ice. And the reason for that is we need to have a super low temperature and the, uh, the salt helps. Can you see it down there, Corky? Yeah, I can. The salt helps to make sure that that temperature is nice and low. So now we've got the salt in there. There we go. All right. Now we're going to seal this bag super de duper de good. Okay, I see. Mm -hmm. And then, Corky, we're going to start to shake it around. Like see the ice in there and the bag of milk and vanilla and sugar? So we're going to shake it around. We're going to keep shaking it for about five minutes. So Quirky, I'm going to pause this video so we can shake it for five minutes and we'll come back when it's ice cream, okay? Okay, sounds good. All right, Quirky, it's been about five minutes that we've been shaking and smushing up this bag of ice with our milk and vanilla and sugar inside of it. Are you ready to see if it's ice cream yet? Oh yeah, I sure am. All right, Quirky, whoops, sorry, bud. I'm gonna open this up. There it is. I'm going to take out the bag. Oh, there. Let's wipe it down a little bit. Over there. Let's see. Let's see if we have ice cream. Let's show the friends what it looks like inside. Take it down a little bit. Oh, quirky look. Oh boy, that looks good. Mmm, that is so good. Oh, all right, Quirky, you want to try some? 
Oh man, that is so good. That really is good, isn't it, Quirky? So now we've made some ice cream and guess what? What? It is time for our special trip to go to an ice cream place. Oh yippee, yippee, ice cream for ice cream. We all ice cream for ice cream. Ah! All right, Quirky. Friends, we're gonna go head to Miss Denise's car and buckle up and be on our way. We'll see you in just a minute. All right, Quirky, here we go. Into Mrs. Denise's car. I see we've both got our masks. Look, your mask has your name on it. That's pretty cool, Quirky. All right, here we go. All right, Quirky, here we are at our special place. You did a great job staying buckled safely in your seatbelt. Let's get you unbuckled. Here we go. All righty. Come on, my friend. Hey, Quirky, are you ready to go inside Hoffman's? Yeah, I sure am. All right, here we go. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. Here we go. All right, Quirky, here we are at Hoffman's. Look, we're with Mr. Kevin. Hi, Mr. Kevin. Hello. And Quirky, what kind of ice cream would you like? Oh, I really like that blue one down there. Oh, Mr. Kevin, what's that blue one called? It's cotton candy. <gasps> cotton candy, Quirky. Oh, yeah, 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 that's my favorite. All right, let's, let's have a scoop of that. that color. Oh boy, that looks good. Oh, thanks, Mr. Kevin. I'm going to eat that pretty soon. Thank you. Oh, Quirky, look at all the flavors. Oh, I see cotton candy again. Look at all the flavors of ice cream. Oh, so many flavors. Look at just goes on and on and on. And Quirky, look, they even have ice cream cakes. Yummy. Maybe when it's your birthday, we'll get you an ice cream cake. Here's the big freezer with all the containers of ice cream. Yummy. Thanks, Hoffmans, for having us today. Corky and I sure had fun. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Ah! <laughs> Oh, Quirky, you are so funny. We sure did have a good time at Hoffman's, didn't we? And now that we're home, we can take our masks off. So let me take mine off and let me take yours off. There we go. Oh, that's better. But I know we do have to wear masks when we're out and about so that we're safe and everyone else is safe. Yes, that's right, Quirky, and you do a great job of wearing your masks. Hey, 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 Miss Denise, let's share those funny ice cream books you read to me. Okay. You want to tell the friends where we got them? Oh, oh, we got them from the Carroll County Public Library. Yep, you can't get into the library quite yet, but you can request books by going to www.car.org and requesting some books. And guess what? You can pick them up at any branch you want at a time that's convenient for you. You are very good at that, Quirky. All right, let's show them the book, shall we? Oh, yeah, yeah, that first book. Ha <laughs> ha! Should I Share My Ice Cream by Mo Williams. Oh, yeah, 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 poor elephant. He's got some ice cream, but he's got to decide if he should share it with Piggy. Oh, I don't know if I could share my ice cream. I do love ice cream. Well, he does have to decide if he should share it with his friend Piggy and whether or not the ice cream will be melted before he gets there. We'll have to read the book to see what Elephant does. Oh yeah, that's a great book by Mo Willems. Get that other book. Okay, here we go. Oh yes, here it is, Quirky. Groovy Joe, Ice Cream and Dinosaurs. Ah, oh, this is a great book. I love this book. And it's by Eric Litwin, who wrote quite a few of Pete the Cat books and illustrated by Tom Lichtenheld. It's a great book about Groovy Joe. Yeah, yeah, Groovy Joe is a dog. Oh, he's a funny dog and he plays the guitar and he has some ice cream and a spoon and he's ready to eat it and then, oh no, a dinosaur comes along and he has to decide if he's going to share it with that dinosaur or eat it himself. Ha <laughs> ha! And wait till you see what happens. Get this book from the library. You're going to love it. Quirky, that's a nice commercial. Thanks, Miss Denise. Well, you know, Quirky, it is time for us to say goodbye. That means I know that's our goodbye song, and then I get to jump into your green bag. Hey, where's that green bag? Where, where is it? Where, where is it? Oh, I've got it, Quirky, here it is. There it is, oh yes, Miss Denise's green bag. I just love that green bag. 
Well, Quirky, let's do a special shout out. Thank you to Huffman's Ice Cream in Westminster. Oh yes, Huffman's, thanks for having us and giving us a tour. And you sure do have great ice cream at Huffman's in Westminster, Maryland. Yay, support local. <laughs> That's right, we do like to support local, don't we, Quirky? We sure do. Okay, time for our goodbye song. Ready, friends? Sing with us. Goes like this. With our hands, we clap, clap, clap. With our feet, we tap, tap, tap. Now it's time to say goodbye. Blow a kiss, Mwah! and wave goodbye. Bye, everybody. Here comes my favorite part. I get to jump in the green bag. Well, what would you like to count to today, Quirky? Well, I have three scoops of ice cream on my ice cream pin, so I think I'd like to count to three. All right, friends, help us count to three, and Quirky will jump in Miss Denise's green bag. Here we go, ready, friends? One, two, three, here I go. Bye, friends, bye, just bye, Miss Denise, bye, Quirky. Ooh. Good job, friends. You got Quirky in there. Well. It's been fun hanging out with you today, talking about ice cream and making ice cream, and I hope you get a chance to make some ice cream and enjoy some ice cream yourself. Take care of each other, and remember, be kind. Mwah. Bye. See you next time.